Hello there apps by viewers, my name's Peter and I've got a hands-on video for you. This time it is with Seabeard. So this is a free-to-play uh, adventure game, I suppose you'd say. Um, it's kind of a unique one, really. So um, let's travel f uh, from the island that I'm on to Accordia. So to do that we're going to play target range. So I am the boat in the middle, I'm floating on the sea. Everything looks very nice, doesn't it? Need to tap um, targets to shoot them and avoid bystanders. Uh, so let's shoot the bad guys. There we are. So you're sort of shooting these creatures and also just, you know, targets. And making you sure you don't touch uh, any of the sort of innocent civilians. There we go. We're getting there, we're getting there. So it, it all looks very impressive, doesn't it, visually? Um, it's rather nice. It's got this um, cartoon look to the whole thing. There we are. Good, missed that one. And hitting those crabs and hitting that and that and that. There we go, 24 out of 28, not bad. And for it, we get a silver chest. And what's that got in there? Five of those doohickeys, brilliant, excellent. So we've arrived in Accordia, and uh, what we want to do is we want to go and give the fish that we caught on the previous island to uh, our fishmonger. So um, if I zoom out a little, there we are, um, you'll see that I've got this little area here. Just here is um, a little house that's being rebuilt, and all of this island is being rebuilt, really. Um, and you're doing it with the help of some other people. So in my party, I've got a fisherman, and uh, that's useful because it means that I can sell fish uh, to this person. So Gregor Monkfish says, hey, you got some lovely seafood for me to sell then? And I'm like, yo, you know I do. So I'm gonna transfer that. And um, they said seafood. I think I can also use uh, clams as well if I want. There we go, so I've done that. And, uh, oh, fantastic, there we are. Lovely. So, uh, he's going to sell that, and uh, we can then go and talk to this entrepreneur, sort of trader, businessman person. And uh, that's helping us, you know, that's helping us level up, it's helping us get money, and uh, we've unlocked all of the following items. Fantastic, there we go. Uh, that should suffice now, but uh, there will come a time when you'll want to expand, when that time comes you know where to find me. Uh, seek out Rudolf, my able apprentice. I believe he has some important news. So then, there we are. I'm being given a, uh, you know, a a new mission to take on, and uh, there we are. I can speak to Rudolf, the apprentice. Would you look at that. We've not been here ten minutes, and Accordia already has its first business in four decades. To commemorate this new beginning, I think it only fair that you grace the island with the name of your choosing. Head over to the sign by the docks and change it to whatever. Heart, your heart desires, as long as it doesn't desire something rude. Well, it always does, but uh, fair enough. Um, so, what I really love about this game is that it always gives you the next objective, and you can always get there really quickly. So, you, you know, you can sort of tap about and move like this. You know, you can you can move about manually, uh, or I can just like zip over there, and they move instantly. They auto path fine to it. And uh, what what should we call it? Let's call it. Uh, App Spy Town. Uh, let's call it that. Done. App Spy Town. So we've named our island. So that's finished that that bit of a quest, and we go back to you know this person over here. You know you would call this um, App Spy Town, really? I love it. Well, of course you do, because you love App Spy, don't you, Rudolph Tail Weaver? Um, you know this is. Um, the kind of game that you might call, I mean it's got like the quests of your sort of typical RPG almost. Uh, let's open the crew screen, put on an adventure hat. Okay, so we're going to do that, we're going to go to crew and we can deck out our, uh, uh, our uh, characters in different things. So here's my clothing, I'm going to pop on the adventure hat, there we are. He <laughs> he, look all cool, completed that, there we are. Let's look at you, Seabird would be proud. Seabird, by the way, the game gets its title from uh, a, a sort of, I guess a pirate or a 
sort of seafaring man who helped build this island into what it was, and then the island kind of got destroyed in some way. Uh, so there's a lot of story here, and there's a lot of, uh, you know, adv adventuring. Um, and setting sea, uh, you know, setting to sea and going out and seeing all this amazing stuff. Uh, trading, fishing, uh, all sorts, really. There's loads of stuff in here, and it all looks absolutely fantastic. Uh, so let's go out here and then let's set out once more on the high seas. Arr, arr. Where are we going? Uh, let's go to... Where do we want to go? Speak to Amelia Quickblade. Uh, she was Seabird's most trusted warrior. So can we... Where are we going? Ah, so it's over here. So we're going to set out this way, I think. <laughs> because we've unlocked this new area, basically. And there's Jeff Scott. Grrr, Jeff Scott and Rin Santori. Grrr, Rin Santori. Who else? Oh, just Jeff Scott, Scott and Rin Santori. Uh, good. They're not too far ahead of me. Um, so let's... Ooh, we could change the minigame if we don't like the one that we've got. Or we could do Dangerous Waters. Let's do Dangerous Waters. So this is another one. We just have to avoid the hazards. Let's get out of the way of that. So we're just doing that by swiping. Ooh, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, we're doing all right so far. Doing all right so far. So you get these, you know, as as you're traveling between islands. And, ah, uh, oh, I smashed into something. And you're rated, you know, bronze, silver, and gold. Oh, nuts. Um, oh, it's all gone to, it's all gone to pot. It really has. So, you know, it's odd, isn't it? You know, a free-to-play adventure game, a free-to-play story-driven game, they're not that... They're not that um, common, let's say. They really aren't. Um, and... Would you like to... No. And especially one that is as great-looking as this. So let's go up here, and you'll notice that if I tap them, we get there pretty quickly. We get there pretty sharpish. Um, so the game kind of skips ahead. There we are. Quick Blade Academy turns wet blankets into worldly warriors. Sign up. Uh, hey, I'm not a customer. Rudolph sent me. <laughs> all sorts of toughening up and challenging and training and all good stuff in here. Help out three people. There we are. So again, we're given another quest. And that's really how the game kind of pans out. Um, there's a lot to it. Um, there's a lot that you can do in it. There's all sorts of customization. The game is not out just yet. It's in soft launch, um, but it's in soft launch in a couple of different places. Mexico, the Netherlands, and Canada, uh, as I'm reading from my list. Um, and um, I'm, 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 I'm quietly impressed. Like... I'm thinking that this could be pretty big uh, when it launches globally, so I um, wanted to bring you a very quick hands-on, just kind of show you what it's all about, really. Um, I've got a good feeling that this could be big, so um, so yeah, definitely keep your eye out for Seabeard from Hand Circus. This is Peter with AppSpy.com. We review, you decide.